Hello friend, in this video I will show you how to run Windows 11 Live on a USB drive. To run Windows 11 Live Desk on a USB drive, you need to create a bootable USB drive with Windows 11 ISO file. Ok, let's see how to do this. First of all, download Rufus, then Windows 11 ISO file. Lastly, we need a USB drive. External USB 3.0 supported SSD drive may improve your speed and reliability. Now install or run Rufus. I am using portable version so I don't need to install. Select your USB drive from the device list. If you are using external hard disk or SSD then press Alt plus F. Or you can check mark on here. Click on the select button next to the boot section option and choose the Windows 11 ISA image you downloaded earlier. In the image option section, select Windows Duo. And the partition scheme section, select MBR if your computer uses WAS or GPT if it uses UEFI. Volume level, this is an optional. And click on the start button. Choose the edition from the list. Now customize Windows installation according to your needs. After that, click on OK. Rufus will now format your USB drive and create a bootable live Windows 11 USB drive. This process may take several minutes and depends on the speed of your USB drive. The bootable live Windows 11 USB drive has been created. Now you can restart your computer and boot from the USB drive. To do this, use the boot menu shortcut key during startup. Select the bootable live Windows 11 USB drive. For testing purpose, I have removed the physical hard drive of my computer. This is opening for the first time, so it will take some time to complete. Once the process is complete, no setup is required. As it happens after installing Windows for the first time. Once done, you can use Windows 11 from your USB. If you want to use it from USB, you have to select USB tools from the boot menu every time. This allows you to use Windows 11 and its feature without making any changes to your existing operating system. Note that after booting from the USB drive, you can choose to run Windows 11 Live without installing it on your computer. Windows updates and app installs will gradually increase the size and reduce the disk space along with Windows performance. So I would recommend it using more space with a USB SSD. That's it, now you know how to run Windows 11 Live on USB drive using Rufus. If you have any questions about this, you can feel free to comment down below and I will try to answer. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. See you at the next one. Goodbye.